G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Let's Play, Let's Go, Let's Do, and um, we're going to be doing a an arc, let's say it like this. This is my Ling family arc. It's not going to be very, well, it's not going to be at all like um, my previous uh, videos when I was doing the Let's Play for Kovalex, or Kovalex, however you want to say it. Um, so, yeah, generally the gist of this one, well, today's video, is more so, I've basically gone through the mission profiles and I've actually seen that there is a package right here I can pick up. So I said, well, bugger it. Why not just pick it up while I'm here? And that is the plan. So I've selected it, I've got it, and I get concerned when I see the marker on the floor and no fucking package. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm remembering why I stopped doing the Link Family package pickup route. All right, so this is bringing back some painful memories for me, especially, and I don't know about you guys, but for me, especially a good portion of the Ling family package pickup and deliveries did not work. I was hoping that maybe that may have been corrected now that I remember why I stopped doing it, but it looks like it hasn't. So that mission I just picked up is pretty much a dead mission, which means two things can happen. Either I'm going to log out and lose brownie points for it, meaning the actual um, the progression through the career path, or the game's going to crash and I don't lose any points for that. Again, progression through the career, career path. Blech. I'm hoping for it to crash because I don't want to spend the rest of my life trying to go and find the one mission that actually works. Um, in, in addition, I recently watched uh, the 1980s version of Top Gun, and I'm I'm just wanting to fuck around oh, after a good one, Evan, smacking into the side of that bloody pillar. But I'm um, I'm thinking of doing something that I've seen in the movie and I've always wanted to do. Yeah, you know what this is. So those of you that have actually seen Top Gun, and I'm really meaning the um the old one, not the new one. I haven't seen that one yet. Um, but yeah, there is a if you've seen it, then you know exactly what I'm doing. If you haven't seen it, then you've got no freaking idea what I'm doing, and you just think I'm crazy, which is also true. But at the moment, I'm looking into this guy's ship, and yeah. Eh. Well, oh, that was underwhelming, wasn't it? All right. It would have been funny if there was the actual pilot in there, but he must be buggered off either trying to look for loot boxes, or he's just logged out. Alright, well, there it goes. So, that's a funny one now, isn't it? So that mission that I first selected is a bust. Bugger. <laughs> now we have to select others. And God help us that it actually works. So what have we got here? This one? Yep, that one maybe... I don't know, shall I just, yeah, let's select this one. So I did mention in the last video I was going to select all of them at once, but after that little, let's just say, friendly bug, I don't want to do that. Let's go one at a time, for the moment, and let's make note of which places work and which ones don't. So here I am, I'm at my pickup point, this shouldn't be too difficult. Um, has it loaded or am I missing some? Okay, good. Three packages, cool. It is three, right? One, two, yeah, it looks like three. So, you know the routine here. Rinse and repeat. Come in, pick up, and go. Now, I, I didn't mention it at the beginning of this video, and you're probably wondering why I mentioned it. Um, in previous Let's Plays, when I've done things like this, it's always been like one episode, one package, or if I can do some interesting shit, let's go for it. In this particular video series, I'm going to do it as a bit of a, an arc, which means I'm going to progressively tell the story uh, all the way through. The story is how I'm actually going to get up to the 45k run. That's the story. <laughs> so let's see how this looks like. Okay, that's a bit too close for, even for me, but all right. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Okay. Um, that's not a good thing, is it? Uh, if I knew how to add music, I would probably add something with a bit of salsa and jumping up and down. Speaking of jumping up and down, can I get into the damn ship? Oh, 
Obviously, I can't go from underneath because I'll probably get killed. Fortunately, this ship you can access from the front as well. But I'm just trying to... No, not close the canopy. I'm trying to jump into the seat. Oh. <laughs> this is fucking nuts. I'm going to fall off, I know. Yeah. <laughs> I saw that one coming. Oh, look at that. And, and no, this is not me being funny with the camera. This is just literally, this is what's happening. Um, I need to get in. Oh, that's fucking annoying now. Will it let me in? All right, that's good. Oh, jeez. Is it going to let me in? Oh, he's falling down. He's up. Okay, he's in. Good. Jesus, turn the engines on, Ev. <laughs> Let, let's, let's put a little bit of distance ahead of us, shall we? Yeah, a little bit more. Alright, so let's have a look. Does that look respectable? <laughs> I think it does. Alright, I'm just moving. It's funny, I'm scrolling and I'm also lifting my head up. It looks ridiculous, there we go. Um, yeah. And again, this would be one of those things where you wish the wheels would actually move. So when you apply a little bit of acceleration, it can actually still go even when you're on the ground. Um, but obviously, that's okay. That will survive. Engines are off. We're all good. Let's get out of here and from the back this time and see how it is. Hopefully not horrific. All right. It's there. Let's have a look. Alright, it's not jumping up and down, so that's fine. And now, poor, this place is fucking dirty as. Yeah, Jesus Christ, doesn't anybody clean in here? Okay, what do we got here? Oddly enough, I've never seen this place before. Uh, well, maybe let's say it like this. I probably haven't had the time to explore it. But that's cool. There was nothing there for me to loot. How about over here? <laughs> Fuck all. All right, out I go. Let's see. Obviously, I'm picking up a package here. Can I pick up anything else? Any loot boxes? Nope. 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 All right, picking up my packages. Looks like it. That's one. Now I'm. I'm thinking. I'm thinking of trying something different. I don't know if it's gonna work. But I'm going to try. I'm thinking about placing them all in the airlock. Yeah. And the reason why I'm doing that is because, well, one, I want to test it. And two, I actually want to see if um, they're not going to fall through the ground and just go away. Or that I can actually do this going forward. Because that would avoid me going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. At least this way... You can just, okay, that one isn't going anywhere, that's cool. So I can drop this one here. Think of this as like what I do when I place things on the elevator. Same type of an idea. So I just want to grab, put it in, and then see what happens. So it, it stops the whole like going through the pressurization, depressurization process of the airlock. I mean, you guys watching them after it's been edited, yeah, no problem. Me playing, eh, you get a bit annoying sometimes. Uh, so let's just see. We'll do it once through. Let's let's just see how all this goes. Okay, that's not too bad. All right, so bounce, bounce. That didn't look good. <laughs> okay, fuck. All right, so all the packages are on board. And yes, that little, um, let's just say, hint did work quite well. So I'm happy about that. And here I come. Bit of a delay. All right, so this is my first package delivery place. Okay, things are loading as I'm coming closer. That's nice. Let's see. Am I going to do this one like this? Why not? I hope I have my landing gear down. We'll find out as soon as I land. Now, I should have probably seen where to actually drop off the package. Ah, you mongrel. <laughs> it's right in front of me. Damn it. Uh, for those of you that listen, you'll understand why I'm actually saying that. It's purely because um, I usually like to position the ass of the ship in the place where I'm actually delivering the package just to save a bit of time. But hey, it, it's the Ling family. Something's going to happen event. Well, 
<laughs> okay. Um, I, I, I don't know what the hell happened there. Okay, the other packages are there. Oh, that's fucking weird. Alright. Hmm. Alright. Um, can't argue with that. Let's just go and drop him off. Oh, I love these moons. That's the one thing I love about the moons. Low gravity. So let's drop this one off. And then we'll have a look around and see if I'm going to loot anything. But don't worry, I won't put you all through the um, the torture of me looting. But you will have to look around. Haha. <laughs> Alright, so this one's in there. Anything here? Nah. That's annoying. Alright. Ooh, I didn't notice that before. Is that a tank? It is a tank. I didn't know we had tanks in this game. Huh. There you go. Learn something new every day. When did Star Citizen get a tank? And why can't I go inside of it? <laughs> Alright, bugger it. Off I go. But that's cool. That is so cool. I might have to take a screenshot of that one. I've never seen a tank in this game. Oh, wouldn't it be cool if it was a hack? We saw something that hasn't been released yet. That would be awesome. But have a look at this. This is brilliant. Look at that. There we go. I'm going to attempt to fly. Nope. <laughs> Shit. Put the landing gear in there. There you go. Oh, I so suck at flying in third person. I think I was better with the freelancer. All right. Well, let's go to the next place, shall we? Let's, but this is awesome. Look at the terrain. I can't fly for shit, but look for the terrain. <laughs> All right, so apparently there's somewhere here where I need to land, and I'm going to do this as much as I can in third-person view. Why? Because it's fucking different. It's just really different, and I want to challenge myself. Well, not... Oh, hang on. Is there something over there? Don't worry, if it gets too tedious, I'll definitely put the... Um, I'll go back into the cockpit to see what's going on. Oh, there we go. Hey, 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 look at that. All right. So this is where I need to go. That's cool. I'll turn around, line myself up. Just kind of straighten myself up a little bit. Put the landing gear down. Do I have it down? Yeah, I can see the shadow. So that hopefully it's down. If not, this is going to be really stupid. Oh, and a little bit of a slide as well. So, in I go to this icy place. Oh, Medbed looks like it's seen better days. Um, Alright, here we go. Oh, okay. Just so you guys know, I hate placing things there. Because they don't usually work for me. But let's see. Alright. Oh, look at that medbed. I was going to see if I could actually get on it, but... Uh, <laughs> No, I couldn't, and looking at all the blood there, maybe a good thing I didn't. Okay, so we're up again. Let's go to the next place, shall we? Here we go, coming in for a landing. Is that a landing pad? No, nope. that's another, oh, it's another station. Ah, oh, it means I have to place something, isn't it? Shit, I hate these things. Like I said, you guys got to watch out for these things. Um, I personally hate them because they don't really work. Putting him into the machine works better than just placing him on the rack for some god unknown reason. And here we go. Bum of the truth. Did it work? Fuck, it didn't. Bloody typical of the Ling family. Shit. Ah, I always hate these ones. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is not going to work. Thanks for watching, and let's see you in the next one.